M0FXB. Welcome to my unboxing of the PrepCom MMX0 model. There is also the DMX40 that includes a transceiver that's built into the same case. This did come, come with a cover that it sat on just here. It just clips over the front there. It also includes a black keyboard here, which is recommended to be used with this device. And there's a USB-C connector there. And you note that there is a key in out and audio in and out. Now, this device works using audio. My kit, because it's the bundle that they advertise, and this is a decoder and an encoder advertised as an intelligent Morse code decoder. Mine came with the stand, okay? stand so just so you can sit this at an angle it just clips on the back so you've got two feet here a couple of ad adapters there two uh, 3.5 to the, the the large size whichever that is and then two cables now i've been reading what is the difference between the two cable selections i feel that this cable here is more designed for the dmx 40 model and it says it here there are two cables and I've underlined what it says the one with the short cable leading to a one quarter inch jack is is the key out assembly and then further on it says the long cable with the 3.5 stereo plugs into the external transceiver uh, key and jack okay now at the bottom here it says the other assembly is the audio assembly 3.5 end with two cables connected plugs into the audio in jack on the mmx dmx so i think that's the one i'm going to use uh, so here's the two cables just so you can see them now there's so many cables let me move one completely out of the way here's one with with two jacks 3.5 and then you've got this here as well that i believe you can plug your key into and so I'm not confirming which one I'm going to use because I have to play first. And then you've got here one, two, three. So actually, I'm now looking at it. I feel like I'm going to be, going to be able to plug one end into the front phones on the 7300 that I'm going to test it with. And then you've got two other connections here that go, go here, I would say. Um, but yeah, let me do it. This is just an unboxing. I wanted to show you what you get in the kit. I'll quickly show you the keyboard. Here's the keyboard, looks like any other keyboard, USB-C, there's the feet, and there is a, a nice little rag here for cleaning your lens, but there's also a cable to power the unit, which looks like this, trying to keep out of the reflection. I will turn it on. Now you've got your USB cable that goes into here, and then into a, you know, a five volt, I would say, what, one amp source maybe, I, to be on the safe side probably two out and it's not a transceiver so it's going to need less power than the the dmx 40. so here's the cable that they provide now i've actually got adapters here it's like the, the one that, that comes with it is the sort of mini usb i've got an adapter here if i plug that into there and i can actually use usb c on mine and these adapters are a, a couple of pounds so let's just turn it on i'm just going to quickly show you the the sort of initial setup I'm plugging in one of my cables here, so the cable that comes with it isn't green, but plug it into there and then press the on button. Okay, very, very nice clear screen. Looks like 3.5 inch to me. I'm going to try and avoid the glare. And so then we're going to, it is touch screen. We're going to grab my little touch thing here and try and keep out of the glare and just go menu. And notice we've got here call no ccs external and menu so we're just going to hit menu and then we'll go with the local station setup tap the screen see if i can do that now i'll plug in my keyboard a minute see if i can type my my call sign let's go m zero and the keyboard works nice feels nice as well nice keys fxb and then we're going to go next Enter your name or your handle. So I'm going to go A N D R E A S. Uh, next location. So I'll just go for now. S W for Southwest UK. Just for now. Next uh, rig type is going to be ICOM. IC 
7300 next uh, antenna type i'll just put in long wire for now although I'm, i've actually got a loop that i'm thinking of using in my kitchen on this and next screen feels nice i'm going to go extra because i've got the full license finish and that means it will make sure that you know you're working on the parameters that you're meant to so i mean this isn't a setup video now but i'm just going to quickly plug in um those two cables here and plug the other end into the phones out on my 7300 one thing i did forget was the typing speed so we'll go menu typing speed i'm just going to put in 22 for now let's get my go to my keyboard 22 next it took me straight, straight, straight to 60. It says here, below is the maximum typing speed based upon the test. This is the maximum speed the transmitter will go edit using the keyboard range from 5 to 60. I'm just going to go save. So if you've got the, the DM, DMX40 transceiver, you, you can tap here and switch between the two, but this one hasn't got that. Have a quick look at the other menu items. So you've got help here, uh, receive help, different keys you can press. Uh, go menu again, help, uh, transmit help, tips there. Go, try again, memories, finish. And let's go menu, micro programming, micro, micro programs. Exit menu and exit menu there. And that's your local setup if you want to do that again. Finish. So, okay. And then I notice if you tap that, then you're back into your receive screen. So I think then the next videos will, I, will be how to use this with different radios. Thanks so much to uh, Eric for sending me this Alpha Foxtrot 7 Yankee Quebec. And um, yeah, more videos to come. Bye for now. Very nice unit. Very nice unit. Has a cover, and completely happy with the quality. Seven three.